Hello Decoders, Decode This. I'm here with Genevieve. Hi everyone. So David's family for Christmas decided to give me this lovely book, American English and English American Translation. Because for some reason they don't think that I would understand the British slang. You don't. And I don't. <laughs> so What we're going to do with this video is to go through different letters of the alphabet. And I'm going to choose a word at random that is in English, and she has to guess what the American equivalent is. So are you ready? No. <laughs> Perfect. Right, we'll start off a bit easy. Autumn. Fall. Oh, okay, that was easy. Bill. Check. Hmm. Contraceptive? Isn't a contra... What? Like... Do I know the American version? Isn't that the same thing? I don't know. Rubber? Oh, like a condom? Yes. No, that is true. We do call it rubbers. <laughs> Courgettes. Oh, oh, I learned this one on this trip. Zucchini. Oh, 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 this is a good one. Okay. Drawing pin. Drawing pin? It's like a bowling pin? No. I don't know. You call them thumbtacks. Like a push pin or? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Estate car. Estate car. I don't know. The main car? The main family car? I don't know. Station wagon. Station wagon? <laughs> that doesn't even... Why would that be an estate car? That's stupid. Well, it says there. First floor. Ground floor? <laughs> I don't know. You call it the second floor. The second floor? No. <laughs> the first floor is the floor you walk in. No, that's, that's the ground floor. No, there's no such thing as a ground floor other than a first You're in floor. England, it's ground floor. A gramophone. We saw a gramophone and you said a gramophone and I was like, yeah. Yeah, that's the English version. Well, what did we call it then? A phonograph. Oh, yeah, I guess so. I think you're more English than you realize. <laughs> <laughs> a hair clip, or known as a Kirby grip here. Is it like the cloth type clips? Just a normal barrette? No, oh, I, you're asking someone who doesn't use them. The bobby pin. Oh. An interval. I don't know. We use the word interval. What do they think it is? Intermission. Oh, intermission? You guys don't use intermission? We have intervals. A jab, an injection type. Oh, I, I learned this over Christmas. It's a shot. A kiosk, telephone slash cigarette. Usually a kiosk at home is like, um, like a ticket booth or... Well, it works out that it was a booth. A lavatory. Bathroom. You could have also had toilet or John. Do you guys not use John? A Macintosh. An apple? <laughs> I don't know. No, it's a type of apple, like Granny Smith, Beverly Hills. It's Macintosh <laughs> apple. That's why on Apple it's called a Mac because they were That's called That's not Macintosh. the point! The point is, is that we call something a Macintosh, you call it a... Apple! <laughs> <laughs> It's a raincoat. A raincoat? <laughs> Noughts and crosses. What type of raincoat? Is it like... <laughs> <laughs> Noughts and crosses. Noughts and crosses. I don't know. Um, let's come up with a fake answer. The skipping Sunday school. Knots during the crosses. Tic-tac-toe. Tic-tac-toe the game? <laughs> That's funny. An off license. An off license, the opposite of an on license. It's a liquor store. No, I didn't know that. <laughs> Are these words you actually commonly use? Sometimes. Pram. Was it a baby stroller? We'll accept it. it was a, according to this, it's a baby carriage or baby buggy. A quay. Quay. A bog? <laughs> what? I don't know. It's a wharf or a pier. Oh. 
Reception. The wait desk? Like, waiting room? It says front desk, we'll accept it. Oh, yeah. Skipping rope. Jump rope. A spanner. A wrench. A tadpole. Like a baby frog? Yes. A tadpole. Not going to this. What do we? What else do we call them? Pollywog. Oh yeah, <laughs> but I don't know. It's not really common. I call them tadpoles though. Trousers. Pants. <laughs> a vest. We wear vests too. Or an undershirt. Oh, you guys' vests are something different. Wardrobe. Closet. Apparently there's no Y. Why? Why? Z. What? Z. Yay. See, I said we say Z. And you say Z. 